Are we ready? Yeah. Okay, we're all ready? Okay, we're good. good. Today at 422, the Clinton County Sheriff's Department received a call from a resident indicating that uh, a plane a plane had crashed uh, here in rural Clinton County. The plane had crashed a short distance from a residence, and there were two, what we believe, white males on board, both that are deceased. And right now, officers from the Clinton County Sheriff's Department and the Missouri State Highway Patrol are conducting a preliminary investigation. FAA has been notified from Kansas City and will be here in the morning to conduct uh, an official investigation into the reason for the crash of the small plane. The plane was a Hyper Cherokee 1967 model. We believe the plane was up here and had circled the residence that's behind me. They were friends with the residents of the home that is, is behind me here. And they had circled the house and for a reason unknown, um, lost altitude and crashed in the pasture beside the house. So they knew the people who lived in the house that they were circling, kind of just being like, hey, we're flying above you right now, and the plane went down? Okay, so it's a traumatic thing for these people too. They weren't like taking any photos of a farmstead or anything like that, it was simply, hey, we're above you right now? It is my understanding <coughs> that the, the family that lives in the home knew the plane was coming, and someone on board was a friend of theirs, and they had circled the house once, and on the second time that they circled the house, they encountered some problems in the plane, uh, plummeted to the ground and crashed. Where did they take off from? That I don't know. And do we know yet where the plane was registered to? Out of We're checking that right now. We, you know, we we have information, but until it's it's definite information that we can verify, we're just not going to say. Mm -hmm. Next of kin is, have not been notified. We're trying to identify the pilot and the passenger that uh, are inside the plane. Do you have an end number for the aircraft that you're able to release it? Not yet. Okay. So with them being friends, you think you know who you're dealing with. You're just trying to confirm. We, we think we have an idea. Of course, until that is verified and checked out, you know, it's just uh, preliminary information right now. So you guys will be, will you hold the scene then overnight until FAA gets here in the morning? Is that kind of how these situations work? Right. What we're going to do is remove both of the bodies from the wreckage, and we will have a trooper or deputy and or deputy stay here through the night with the wreckage until uh, the federal authorities arrive from Kansas City. My first name Sheldon, S H E L D O N, last name Lyon, L Y O N. I'm a sergeant with the Missouri State Highway Patrol. S H E L D O N, last name Lyon, L Y O N. And we don't have the number, the, the number, the tail number, right? And you're a sergeant with the Missouri Highway? Missouri State Highway Patrol. Not MODOC. I'm running that line right now. Although, once in a while, we get, we get uh, referred um, to as MODOC. So, you said it was a 1967 um, Piper Cherokee. Cherokee. Two on board. Sorry, you have Both are fatals. Okay, so two fatalities. Males. Yes, we believe that they are males. Okay. Okay, I thank you. It's hard to do like all of it at once. So any more information you can give us at all? You know, I'm going to go back over there. I don't know really unless uh, Next of Kin is notified in the next, you know, half hour or so. I'm not sure what other okay. information we'll have. More will come tomorrow.